Hey folks, Mike and McGee here. We are so excited on the homestead today. Our pig is a Mangalitsa. I couldn't hardly remember that name, so I called her Mangalitsa. That's her name, Mangalitsa. We've had her for a year and a half now, I think, something like that. She just had her second litter, and we are so excited. This is why we got her, because we wanted to raise some piglets, and she has had the most phenomenal success. Her first litter, she had nine, and she didn't have a runt in the litter. I mean, it was amazing. She raised all nine. This time, she had 10, and the biggest, nicest one was laying there dead when we got there. I think she may have accidentally laid on it because there wasn't anything wrong with it. But with 10 babies, and when you're that big boned as she is, you could accidentally lay on one if it's not really being careful because when you go to lay down, when she goes to lay down, stuff just needs to get out of the way. But anyway, she has nine. They all look healthy. They're not as big as the last ones because they had to share with another guy. But they look really healthy. They all look great. So we are so excited about this. I have heard different stories from different people, friends of mine, YouTubers, neighbors, different ones, have not quite had that amount of success i don't know why i do not know why she had was chosen to have the big litters but i am thankful for it and i'm just going to keep feeding her the good old trucker's favorite corn which is like the best corn on earth for these pigs they do so well on it. and our cornfield is starting to dry down it won't be long they're going to have even fresher corn from this year so we're extremely excited about it. Let me see if I can grab one of these little guys to show you. I'm gonna reach right down here. Oh no, mama says no. Mama says no. But I, <laughs> I would like to hold one. It's okay, it's okay. Uh-uh, it ain't okay. She said it ain't okay. But I'm gonna still try to get one. These things are striped up so pretty. I cannot believe it. I like Mangalitsa pigs. I really like them. It's okay. Yes, there's a the female. It's okay. It's okay. Anyway, I'm going to put her back in with her mama. Usually they have more females than they do males. I don't know why, but that's been... She don't like it, I tell you what. She's very protective mama, but that's a good thing. I like for her to be very protective. That way, no little coyote's gonna come in here and get them, because we have coyotes around here. I caught four this year, but there's more. We hear them howling at night. So anyway, we just wanted to share that with you. We're so blessed to have Mangalitsa pigs on the homestead again. A lot of good Mangalitsa pigs. I'm gonna give you an update on Wilbur. Wilbur is our barrel. We castrated him to raise as a meat hog and it got too warm before he got big enough. And so he's been all summer eating, getting bigger and bigger and bigger. So I'm gonna do you an update video on him here. I'm not sure when that video will come out, but we definitely will put it out for you. So anyway, we appreciate you watching this video. If you don't know anything about Mangalitsa pigs, you can go into my playlist and look at the Mangalitsa pig playlist and you'll see a lot about them that I can't really just share right here for the sake of time. So we're gonna get on out of here. You guys have a great day. We'll see you on the next video.